Thanks, Geralt. You saved my life. The bastards snuck in here. Somehow they found out I'm after them. Who? What happened? Salamandra. I was a step away from solving the mystery. One small step. Relax, Raymond. You're safe now. Not likely. They're following me day and night. I gotta find a way to lose them. What do we do? I'll set a false trail. You question the new suspects. Who? Here, take these notes. They list all the key leads. What do you intend to do? They're on my heels, so I've got to disappear. I'll draw them away while you pursue the investigation. I'll find you, White Wolf. Yes? I suspect you know about Salamandra. I know nothing. We'll see. Can I return to my business? We need to talk about your dealings with Salamandra. You paid to have the professor released. <laughs> Why would I bother with a criminal? Why not? Would I do it so clumsily as to implicate myself? I don't believe you. I don't have any definitive proof, so I'll let it lie, for now. Wise choice. You should trust your instincts more. Nothing else. Yes? How's business? You think me a seller of turnips? I run businesses you can't even fathom. I see. You're confusing reflected stars for the night sky. I'm waiting for important news. Farewell.
Mr. Marlowe sent me. What's happening? Raymond said he has some new information. Come to his house as soon as you can. Thanks for the message. How strange! Welcome, you won't believe what happened. Tell me. Not so fast. Remember, I have expenses. How much do I owe you? 200 arons. This investigation is getting expensive. I'm not the Prophet Labioda. I can't live on roots and berries. Neither can my informers. I guarantee you these are the bare necessities. All right, 200 orans. Down to business. They transferred the prisoner after the attack. Not good. Especially since we won't get anything else out of him. He died last night. How did that happen? Well, he wasn't in great shape, so I guess it's no surprise. But I have a feeling... Someone helped him along? Exactly. Shani is a good friend of yours, right? Ask her to do an autopsy. Once we know the cause of death... Wait a minute. Are you spying on me? That's my job. See you later. Quickly, I need to get back to work. I need you to help me with an autopsy. What? That's illegal. It's necessary. Visit me at night. We'll talk. See ya. Quickly, I need to get back to work. Welcome, dear. Do have a cup and keep an old woman company. I need to go. Get out! Stomping into my home like that! But... What's she want? Say something! I'm here to see Shani. They send you from the hospital? You certainly look ill. Gods are punishing you. Yes, I'm from the hospital. You can go upstairs. Just don't force yourself on the girl. Yes? Shani, I wanted to ask you something. Mm-hmm. I need your help with an autopsy. An autopsy? Since when do you deal with stuff like that? Since I started investigating Salamandra. Okay, though, I'm no coroner. You'll have to interpret our findings. We'll meet in the evening. Until then, gather as many clues as possible. I'll sniff around. Get the body from the grave digger. We'll meet at the hospital in the evening. How do I find information to help the autopsy? 
Ask Vincent Mice, but also look for books on anatomy and pathology. Farewell. So what'll it be? We doing some ploughing business? Hell with it. What is it, Witcher? You ever do autopsies? What for? Punctured stomachs mean gang warfare. Torn off heads mean beasts. And black tongues mean poison. The first case, we pressure ram's meat. The second, we pass on to the Order or a Witcher. The third, we go to the victim's wife. The culprit 90% of the time. Autopsies are a waste of time. The prisoner died recently. Is he in the cemetery already? Don't know. You can have another body. They all reek the same. I'm after a specific corpse. Particular. Come back when you know what you want. Examining remains is an art. Always worthwhile to look deeper. But who does that concern? Could you hand over the prisoner's body for an autopsy? For a bottle of dwarven liquor. What do you need? Two ditches more. Bury me. Hello. Fancy a meal? Or have you another reason for coming? What other reason? There's a comfortable bed out back. What'll it be?
eternal fire fill my heart. Ashes to ashes. What do you need? Nothing like a good drink. About the prisoner. Where you want the body dumped? At the hospital. It'll be there by evening. Farewell. So what'll it be? We doing some ploughing business? Ready for the autopsy? Let's get started. We'll all die. We'll begin in a minute. Race, human. Gender, male. Wounds, extensive. Shani, this isn't a lecture hall. Whatever you say. He died yesterday, torn to pieces. Could a human have inflicted these wounds? Only with a two-foot jaw. The bone marrow has been sucked out. Must be scavengers. Very likely. Plenty around the cemetery. So, he was torn to pieces after he died. I'm interested in the cause of death. I also see some stab wounds. A blade... two fingers wide. External signs aren't everything. His neck muscles and palms look tense. How do you know when he died? Normally I base it on muscle stiffness and dehydration, but rigor mortis is persisting for too long. They say successful autopsies are based on curiosity. Should we look? Let's check his internal organs. The symptoms are peculiar, and the cause of death, too. Those wounds are too obvious. I suspect something more. Poison? If so, a rare sort. Perhaps an alchemist's brew? Kolkstein? Ah! Liver's completely cirrhotic. It was obviously a potent poison. This stinks of alchemy. Any way to confirm that? Yes, alchemist's poisons usually cause certain characteristic changes. Then let's check for those. Look, the tongue was crudely extracted, but not all the blackened tissue was removed. Blackened? Yes, the poison caused necrosis of the tongue, so the murderer removed it. So we're certain a gifted alchemist is the murderer. A gifted alchemist? Who's a crappy surgeon? Kalkstein. 
He wanted to implicate the bandits, but he failed to foresee a professional autopsy. Thanks, Shani. That's the evidence I needed. Good. I'm exhausted. Sorry, I got lost in thought. I suspected you were working with Javed. You think I lead Salamandra? I'll die laughing! I'm certain. You don't fool me with your scholarly guise. You're a fool, Geralt! Yes? I have the autopsy results. And? I'm certain it was Kalkstein. How do you know? The liver was cirrhotic. The stab wounds were just a clumsy attempt to hide the real reason. So, poison after all. But how can you be sure it was Kalkstein? Changes in the eyeballs, typical of alchemical poisons. I see you did your homework. I sure did. Come back later. I need to analyze this information. 